वेलकम बैक टू द फिजिक्स लैब इन द लास्ट लेक्चर आई हैव टोल्ड यू टू मेजर द लेंथ बाय यूजिंग डिफरेंट इंस्ट्रूमेंट्स आई हैव शोन यू द स्केल टू मेजर द लार्ज डिस्टेंसेस लाइक 15 सेंटीमीटर 20 सेंटीमीटर और 50 सेंटीमीटर बाय यूजिंग द मीटर स्केल यू कैन मेजर द लेंथ बट इफ यू हैव टू मेजर द डायमीटर ऑफ स्मॉल ऑब्जेक्ट्स लाइक दिस सिलेंडर द लेंथ ऑफ दिस सिलेंडर द क्रॉस सेक्शन ऑफ दिस सिलेंडर or the diameter of this spherical bob in that situation i have told you to use this instrument that was named as vernier caliper now the situation arises if we want to calculate the diameter of this very thin wire this is the hair like thin wire or you can say if you want to calculate the thickness of paper so these very small size length you cannot measure with the help of scale or with the help of vernier caliper to determine the diameter of this wire or the hair like objects this instrument is used and this instrument is named as screw gauge what is this screw gauge as first part is to discuss the different parts of this screw gauge let let me explain you the different parts of this gauge this this is here in this screw gauge what is visible to you if i am revolving this one scale is visible to you here this scale is known as this scale the divisions are marked on this scale this is known as the vernier scale and as you are able to see that this distance 0 to 5 it cannot be 5 cm na so this distance is 5 mm so this main scale is in millimeters the and this is the circular scale you can see here if i hold it like this one vertical line is visible to you here and this vertical line is coinciding with the zero of this scale zero of this scale if i rotate and give the complete rotation you are able to see this is 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 90 90 and then again the zero of this circular scale this scale which is revolving in circular direction is known as the circular scale and now the zero of this circular scale is coinciding with the vertical line of the main scale so while it is completing its one rotation then one division on the main scale is completed by observing this we can calculate a parameter that is known as pitch pitch is what pitch is the number of the division moved on the main scale that we, that is if i have rotated it one time then one division is on the main scale and one rotation of the circular scale so pitch is the parameter and which is given by as the ratio of division traveled on the main scale divided by the number of rotation of the circular scale as we observe the thing the number of division on this if the number of division is 7 it means the seven rotation are moved by the circular scale and this device is used to measure the diameter first of all how you will measure the diameter of the wire what you will do you will gently close this knob by moving the circular scale and at last before starting the experiment you will completely close it with a gentle touch no pressure should be given here and now watch the reading look here the close reading this is the vertical line on the main scale and this line is exactly coinciding with the zero this line of the main scale is exactly coinciding with the zero of the circular scale it means there is no error the error in this is 
zero nil error but sometimes it may happen that this vertical line of the main scale this vertical line may coincide with any division of the circular scale other than zero in this situation this vertical line on the screw gauge the main scale is coinciding with 20 it means it is reading 20 extra divisions are there when you start to keep any device here to measure the diameter it means it is reading 20 already suppose the diameter of this is having reading 40 and if you move it it will read 60 because it is reading 20 extra divisions so you have to subtract if it is reading extra value it is known as the positive error and for the correction when you do the zero correction then this positive error should be subtracted it means you will subtract 20 from your each reading and the other case if you have uh, actually this is not having error if i move it very tight then 3 4 division in the back direction is moved this is the main scale and it is coinciding with the 97 you cannot write it as 97 you will the count the back counting here it is 3 97 means 3 the back counting it means it is having three less values three less less values and these three less values you will add in your reading because it is three values back from the zero if actual reading is 37 it will read 34 so three divisions you have to add it mean this kind of error is known as the negative error and for correction this error should be added now how to calculate the diameter because this device is not having any error so what you will do you will keep the wire in the center of this given place and you will gently close the knob and after closing this you will observe the main scale reading and the circular scale reading as it is visible to you on the main scale only zero is visible to you no value is there so main scale reading is zero so you will write main scale reading as zero and if you watch it carefully then this value is coinciding with 28 this is the second last from 30 28 value it means the main scale it means the circular scale value is 28 the division is 28 main scale is 0 mm and verni uh, circular scale is 28 now write down these values in the observation table and know how to calculate this is the aim you have to write first the aim the aim is to find the diameter of the wire using screw gauge i have told you to calculate the pitch the number of division on the main scale divided by the number of rotation and in all the cases the both the values are equal hence the pitch is always 1 and now what is the least count least count is the pitch and the number of division in one round the number of division in the circular scale are 100 so the value is 1 by 100 i have told you the main scale is in millimeters so this value is 0.01 mm you can change it in centimeters that is 0.001 for answer in millimeter to decimal places and for answer in three decimal places it will give you the value in centimeters uh, as i have shown you the main scale reading was 0 the circular scale reading was 28 the total reading will be main scale reading plus the circular scale reading circular scale reading is 28 into least count is 0.01 mm so this value is 0.28 mm write the value here 0.28 the diameter in mm suppose the next value first value is x next value is y and th third value is z you will repeat the experiments three times so that the error can be eliminated 
and there was no error zero error was nil so you have no adjustment in the answer and for calculating the mean diameter you will calculate x plus y the first value plus second plus third divide by 3 if you want the answer in millimeter you will round off up to two decimal places and if you want the answer in centimeter you will round off this result up to three decimal places okay now this is all about to find the diameter of the wire by using true gaze for any query you can write your question in the comment box or you can call me note down this